Well, with uh, over two million people in jail, the U.S. has the world's biggest prison population. America's largest prison corporations pour hundreds of thousands into the campaigns of governors, state legislators, and judges. What we're seeing here is the militarization of the police force. Police brutality is at an all-time high. A schizophrenic homeless man was brutally beaten to death by police officers. The outrage in Detroit this morning after a funeral for a seven-year-old girl who was shot and killed by police in a raid on a family home. A former transit police officer has just been convicted in the shooting death of an unarmed man. They don't have the training, they don't have the supervision, they're not held accountable. None of them will be charged with the assaults and batteries that they committed. None of them will lose a day's pay.
The steel that we have on an American dollar bill is an occult steel of an occult society pursuing an occult agenda. We're not talking about something that's entertaining or sensational. We're talking about your government, wh where you live, your country, your freedoms. And what we're talking about here is things which you see every day like someone said a long time ago, many will look with their eyes but not see, and listen with their ears but not hear, and that's us. That is this country. We have been looking at things all along and never realizing the significance of the occult emblems that we're seeing today. We're talking about a global government that's in existence right now. We're not talking about a nation that is going, we're talking about a nation that is gone. We do not control the government of the United States of America. The United States of America is controlled by this evil art. They control the money system. They control the State Department. They control the presidency. And so today, these hybrid bloodlines are known as the Illuminati, the Illuminated Ones, and they're the ones that control the transnational corporations, governments, the banking system that dictates and controls the direction of society.